So then Todd will go back with another video. I'm Strange Wayne, he's Nate, and today we are reacting to the not Dr. Doolittle trailer. Just Doolittle. Just Doolittle. Kinda like me at work. As little as possible. I see trees of green. Red roses Gross. too. I see them bloom for me Gross. and you. And I think to myself. Are you Dr. Doolittle? That's always a good sign. Yeah. We have no choice but to embark on this perilous journey. He doesn't do that since often. Everyone pack your bags! <laughs> you can talk to animals. I'll be eating something right in the face. Babies cry. Watch them grow. They learn much more than I. It's okay to be scared. No. And I think to myself. Hello, Barry. Hello, lunch. We all fucking love this movie, won't you? <clears throat> it's been a hot minute since I've seen Antonio Banderas' name pop up on some movie credits. Facts! I think he's just like Robert Downey Jr. and everyone else in this cast. They're in it for the bag. You know, you saw some talented people in there. Michael Sheen, you know, some others. Well, they're in it for the bag, most definitely. I do like that they're going away from the Eddie Murphy in the original. You know, they're trying to do something new with it. But it looks like I've seen this before. I've seen it done better. This does not look good at all. You know, Disney, they was like, yeah, Magnificent Skulls suck. Alice in Wonderland Skulls suck, so we don't want you anymore in Disney camp. So we're just, you can, you can be universal. You just, so they're like, ah, you got a Disney name, we'll throw you on there. But yeah, this, I'll say this movie looks bad. Hell, I'll say it even looks hot garbage. You wanna know what I did last night? What did you do last night? I was with four chicks. One fell asleep, the white chick was doing coke, and I had the two ebony chicks to myself. We was watching our robot. We definitely didn't finish. This movie does not fit the strange money lifestyle. Clearly! <laughs> no debating! And this is not something I'm on Netflix and chill, chill to. I'm not going to go to the theater to see it. It's not a movie strange way. None of my favorite activities to ah. Uh, English motherfucker, do you speak it? None of my favorite activities are going to be in this movie. So, you won't see me at the theater watching this. Um, you're well aware of how I feel about movies with talking animals. But because we don't have that many subscribers, tell them at home how you feel about I talking animals. I hate movies with talking animals. Especially when they make their stupid CGI mouths move. Time out! If you so it's just live action. It's not cartoon talking animals. Yes, yeah, it's, it's, it usually is pertaining just to live action movies. So all dogs go to heaven? Love it. You... Oh, phenomenal. Love The Lion King. I mean, okay. it's really... For the people at home, I want to make sure they understand. Live action movies with talking animals, I can't stand. I They... To me, it's, it is the cheesiest thing in movies. I would rather watch porn than watch a movie with talking animals in it. it I can't stand it. That being... Is that why you're sitting? Ha! That being said, because if you do by chance are one of the wonderful people who do regularly watch our channel, and you already know that about me, I will add that talking animals themselves are not quite enough to absolutely ruin a movie depending on how often and how they are used and how good the uh, script is and things like that. Thankfully, this movie has plenty of other things that will probably ruin it. Oh, you're right. For one, I know it's just a trailer, but that accent sounds... So fucking terrible! This is not for me. 
So I think we both agree that uh, do little does a little for us. Whack. Tell us what you think down in the comment section below. Like, comment, and subscribe.